Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy D. Lloyd and welcome back to episode number 9 of our Tennessee Titans Connected Career Franchise Mode. So, this week we're going to be taking on your Houston Texans, but they have quite a few injuries. Ryan Mallett is out, Vince Wilfork and Arian Foster all will not play in today's game. Currently we are 4-2 on the year, the Houston Texans are 3-4, and, and they are also in second place in the AFC South. So we're trying to extend, extend our lead against the Houston Texans. But you see Brian Hoyer coming out on the field as the starting quarterback for today's game. And he's going to get things started off by finding DeAndre Hopkins on the nice 19-yard reception. Later on, it is first and 10 for the Texans. Hoyer is going to look to his left, and he is going to find Williams, who comes up with another reception. So they are now in Tennessee territory. Second and 10, Hoyer is going to find Garrett, his tight end. And that is going to be a gain of about eight yards on that one. Later on in this third and two, Hoyer is going to drop back and he is going to find Hopkins again. But this time it is not enough for the first down. So Houston's going to have to settle for three points. So they, they take an early 3 nothing lead. Coming onto the field is Marcus Mariota, 11 touchdowns and five interceptions coming into this game. Right now it is third and 11. We're looking to convert. Mariota's going to look for DGB but he cannot hold on to the football and we're going to be forced to punt the ball going three and out so Houston has the ball once again and this is Chris Polk on the carry he gets a gain of six the very next play second to four is going to be Garrett who comes up with the grab and he is going to have enough for the first down so at this point Hoyer is eight for eight passing right here Jonathan Grimes gets the carry he gets a gain of six which is enough for the first down. Now they're going to give it back to Chris Polk. And he is going to run hard as he gets a gain of eight on that one. Third and two now. They're going to hand it off to Polk up the middle. And he gets enough for the first down. So they are now inside of the 10-yard line. They're going to throw the fade in the corner of the end zone. But look at the play by Paris Cox getting his hands up. And Williams is not able to hold on to it. However, the next play, DeAndre Hopkins comes up with the touchdown reception. So the Houston Texans are leading 10-0. Here is Marcus Mariota. He's going to look to his left, and he is going to throw interception number six on the season. And now the Texans have the football with great field position. But we're able to come up with a big-time sack. So it is now second and 20 for the Texans. However, look at this. Garrett's going to run the post route. And he's going to come up with the catch in traffic. And that is going to give the Houston Texans a third and two. And they are going to convert, hand it off to the fullback. So now second and goal from the nine-yard line. They hand it off to Chris Polk. And he is able to get into the end zone. So the Houston Texans are off to a commanding 17 to nothing lead. So now two minutes remaining in the half. Mariota steps up and he is going to find David Cobb who comes up with the 12 yard reception. Now it is first and 10 and it is Mariota is going to throw this one deep looking for Justin Hunter but he cannot hold on to the football as he absorbed a big time hit. Now second and 10. We're looking for Justin Hunter again but Mariota is going to throw interception number two on the ball game. So after we hold the Houston Texans to a punt. We have the football. We're trying to score before halftime. It is 30 seconds remaining. And look at this catch by Delaney Walker. However, there is going to be a flag on the play, a holding. That's going to set us back. So now, second and 15 from the seven. We're going to run a play action fake. And this is going to be ruled a fumble as Mariota gets hit. And the Houston Texans are going to recover that in the end zone. So at halftime, the Texans are dominating 24-0. We only have five passing yards and nine rushing yards in the first half. That is pretty pathetic. But we're here in the second half. We desperately need a score on this possession if we have any chance of possibly coming back. You see that slip screen to David Cobb. He gets a nice game. Now later, first and 10, we're looking for Delaney Walker. He's going to come up with the grab, but we are now inside of Houston territory. So now it's going to be first and 10 for the Tennessee Titans. And you see Marcus Mariota looking to his left. He sees DGB one-on-one, -on -one and he is going to come up with the great diving reception as we're going to take another look at this one one-on-one -on -one coverage. And Doriel Green Beckham just extends to bring in a great catch. So now I'm feeling like we have a little bit of momentum. We will go 
and get the touchdown right here as David Cobb gets the tough two yard run. So now we're only down six to 24 after the two point conversion failed. But we do feel like if we can get a stop right here, we have a shot of possibly coming down and scoring again. So first down, we get a stop. Second and 11, they hand it off to Chris Polk. He gets a couple yardage, but it is now third and six. We just need a stop right here. They're gonna run with the slip screen and look at the great blocking that he's able to get from his lead blockers. And Chris Polk is gonna take this one all the way down the field, essentially ripping the hearts out of our team. So right now it is third and five. Things are looking very bleak for the Tennessee Titans and it's going to look even worse as we had another shot to hold him to a field goal but Garrett is going to get the first down and then two plays later the Houston Texans are going to run this one into the end zone so we are currently trailing 31 to 6 against the Houston Texans so now if we have any chance at all we need to score and we need to score quickly you see Justin Hunter Coming up with that reception right there. We're now near the 50-yard line. Second and 10. Mario is going to throw it. And this one's going to be caught by Delaney Walker. Look at this. He's going to break out of both defenders' tackles. And we are down to the 26-yard line. So now 50 seconds remaining. We're running no huddle. And Mario is going to step up. He's going to stumble. But he's going to regain his balance. And he's going to slide down safely at the 5. Now third and goal. We're going to hand this one off to David Cobb. And he is able to get into the end zone for six. So we're trying to cut into the lead. But like I said earlier, we need to get stops. And we did just that. So now we have the football back. Six minutes to go. Marcus Mariota is looking down the middle. And this one is going to be picked off. And that is pretty much going to seal it. And that was a terrible interception for Mariota. His third of the game. We will hold Houston to three points. But look at this. When things go bad, everything gets worse. We are going to have a roughing the kicker call. As you look at this replay as well, we barely touch the kicker. But he's going to go ahead and flop. And that is going to give the Houston Texans another chance to possibly score a touchdown. And they're going to do just that as the tight end is able to get in. So that is pretty much going to do it for the ball game. The Tennessee Titans get absolutely dominated as we lose 38 to 13 against the Texans. We fall to 4 and 3 on the year, but we are still in first place in the AFC South with a one game lead over the Houston Texans. So, hopefully we can bounce back from this loss, but that is it for this episode please go ahead and leave this video a like also subscribe if you haven't already it's your boy d lloyd i'm gonna see y'all next time peace